Hi, welcome in. 71. What should I do when I'm treated unfairly? If there's one thing we learn early on in life, it's that life isn't fair. It wasn't fair for Abel, who was killed by his jealous brother. It wasn't fair for Esau, whose brother stole his inheritance. It wasn't fair for Joseph, whose brothers sold him as a slave. It wasn't fair for Jesus, who was beaten and crucified for us. So how should we react when we are overlooked for a place on the team, when someone has more than we have, or when we're accused of something we didn't do? The first thing we should do is check our attitude. We should be humble and unassuming because pride lets us believe that we have a right to certain privileges and that we deserve special favor. We should be thankful for what we've been given in life and learn to be grateful for small things. So how do we manage our feelings of anger when we've been treated unfairly? Let God handle the situation. He will judge the person or, pre or people who have wronged you, which means that you don't have to worry about getting even. See Romans 12 verse 19. If anything, the very next verse tells us to do good to people who treat us unfairly because it will be like piling burning coals of shame on their heads. Ouch. Quiz 71. Whose unfair situation did God use for good? Genesis 50 verses 19 to 20. And there are your choices.